first thing I discovered in doing file work is that you need a jig to hold the, the work with. Um, I try to work on the vise. The problem is if you hold it on the vise and you're trying to file, you, you, you can't get that kind of angle that you want. So uh, again, I looked online and uh, this is uh, uh, a combination of various things and I think that to me this is the ultimate. Um, and I'll just tell you about some of the features uh, of this. At the, at, the, at the bottom is an adjuster which allows you to keep the jaws parallel. Otherwise what's going to happen is if you screw it in, you're going to get that kind of thing and you don't get a lot of, a lot of grip. So, so basically what I do is I, I adjust this until it's that thickness um, and then clamp it in there. Uh, aluminum or steel? It's aluminum, it's just scrap that I had, so the dimensions aren't uh, anything particular. Uh, th th this is 15 degrees, uh, you can probably get away with a little bit more than that. Um, and then the other feature I have in the bottom here is, uh, is this bottom piece, uh, which serves two purposes. The one is to keep the jaws parallel at the, parallel at the top, otherwise what you have to do is you have to run another pin through here to make sure that the jaws don't don't swivel. So that stops the jaws from swiveling, but it also allows me to turn it in the vise. If I want to turn it any any which way, I can turn it without having to clamp and then open up to to, oh. to, to turn it. So that's just a, a little a little thing. You will not see this particular design um, in the sense that uh, the use of this here. They have different ways of doing the, the back pin. Um, and the, the bit at the back here is, is uh, it's just my own idea. Most of them run a pin through here and don't have the bottom part so that uh, to keep the jaws from. from the